Hey Zwifters, this is Eric with Zwift Insider, just uh, announcing really quickly here that Zwift has thrown the switch and the coffee stop feature is now live as of May 10th, about uh, 10 a.m. Pacific time. Wanted to show you a quick demo. Here's one of our bots riding in the Coco RoboPacer group. And if I really click, just bring up the action bar, I'm going to do it with my mouse, clicking on the bottom middle of our screen and you can click the coffee cup brings up a confirmation dialog you can cancel here if you'd like or just click start it's the first five minutes of my ride so I just have a 30 second break available so if I click start now it begins if I drop my power down to zero you'll see that my rider continues to hang with the group and there's a countdown here so I have a 30 second countdown once that's done I need to have my power back up, otherwise I'll drop out the back of the group. Now after five minutes, I will have to ride for another 30 minutes before I'm able to do another coffee stop. And you get three minutes worth of a coffee stop for every 30 minutes of riding at that point. So you get a quick one in your first five minutes, then you get a longer one. Oop, gotta start pedaling. <laughs> you get a longer one. Uh, after that 30 minute break and every 30 minute block after that you'll have a three minute break option these are all or nothing as well so once you start your coffee stop you can't hit pause on it or uh, or use only a portion of it it's an all or nothing sort of trigger anyway hope that's a quick and simple introduction to how it works and uh, enjoy your coffee stops <laughs> right on